video and welcome to day three of vlogtober today we're gonna be doing some major major cleaning and i feel like this video is definitely gonna motivate me to clean because <sighs> lord knows that in a matter of a few minutes anything can get very messy the kitchen is a mess dear lord so today we're gonna clean one by one with magic sir there chill on the bed but like look at how messy it's so embarrassing yep okay so just close your eyes and open them back up and magically clean and here is the room all nice and organized and clean oh my god what jesus christ okay guys you guys ready turn on the lights valerie Yep, this is the situation. Guys, and guess who's gonna clean it? My mom. The situation. My mom's gonna clean it, guess that. <laughs> Valerie's so kind, washing the dishes. But thank you so much. And over here, we have, I have going on, I'm just slightly frying up some potatoes with uh, some avocado oil. Got some onions and two cloves of garlic. And we're gonna put some, we're gonna cook some ground beef in there. And yeah, it's gonna taste super yummy. So I added the ground beef in there. I added my seasonings. Uh, and then I added a couple tomatoes from my mom's garden that she gave me. And I also went ahead and added some pickled jalapenos and some of the juice as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and let that kind of like, let the, you see these little little juices kind of like evaporate so that it gets a little drier and fries up a little more and then it'll be nice and ready. Valerie is enjoying la carne molida con papa with a spinach wrap. How was it girl? Delish. And I set aside uh, for my brother, my sister-in-law and my nephew. <laughs> and I'm gonna take it upstairs in a little bit. I, on the other hand, am not going to have any because it does have carbs in it. So I will be making myself a, capri a caprice salad. My caprice salad. Look at these beautiful, colorful tomatoes. I got these from Amazon Fresh. Uh, they're Wild Wonders Gourmet just colorful tomatoes, okay? Uh, but they're so pretty, they're like so fallsy. And I split, I don't know, I would say like maybe seven of them. And I just mix, mixed in some mozzarella balls, salt and pepper, and some avocado oil. It's Friday night, so we're gonna kick back and relax. And I got these keto-friendly cocktail mixers. Uh, it's by Jordan Skinny Syrups. You guys could find them at TJ Maxx. And this is in the, um, this is in the flavor dragon fruit acai. It's actually pretty good. It's okay, it's not the greatest, but it'll do. And I got these like really pretty like cocktail wine glasses from Amazon. You can't really see it, but it's like iridescent. So beautiful and fragile. And we're gonna take some good old uh, vodka. And we're gonna pour a little bit. And then we're gonna mix in this bad boy right here and then we're just gonna kick back and relax so pretty i love it i am truly truly obsessed with my little setup here it looks so nice and cozy here at night like my living room space has just became so um nice and cozy and so nice like sit back and relax especially after a long long week i still have to take off take that down so i'm actually gonna take that down right now the happy birthday banner but i just love it so much the the setup it is just such a vibe 
What's new? Valerie's skincare routine. That one actually has a skincare routine. I don't have a skincare routine. All I do is just take a shower and put some lotion on my face and that's it. This is like, this is just like that. Like you should see like my room. I have a bunch of skincare in my room. Oh my God, I can't see you girl. Cause of the background. Maybe we should, I mean, would you like to show them your skincare routine in one of the videos? Yeah. Yeah? Nice. Valerie has a skincare routine, I don't. Um, but if you guys are interested to see her skincare routine, let me know in the comments down below. Um, I got my little pumpkin lit over here. And then check out the kitchen. I have my big candle going on here. I just want to show you guys my fall vibes. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> He's over here looking super spooky, but he likes chilling up here. Don't worry, we clean. And yeah, everything looks so nice. Like I even lit up this fall festival candle that I got at Joanne's Fabric. And then in my room, it's nice and cozy as well. And also have a pumpkin spice latte candle lit in here. We are about to watch The Social Dilemma, which has been highly recommended, and it's actually recommended on Netflix, so. What? <laughs> okay. Does that come up? <laughs> Dude. And basically say thank you all Your for skincare coming. routine puts so um, many at shame. <laughs> so today I want to talk about a new agenda. And uh, groceries are officially here. Grocery haul. Okay, so remember how tomorrow we're doing broccoli cheddar soup? Okay, so this is one of the ingredients, which is vegetable stock. We needed some toilet paper, so we got some toilet paper. And then we got some con some conditioner and some head and shoulders. <laughs> some head and shoulders, because they really need it. Some zucchini spirals because I actually want to make uh, fettuccine alfredo, but instead of fettuccine, we're going to use a zucchini. Uh, so it'll be zucchini alfredo. So that'll be like during the, um, maybe Sunday. So I'm going to put this in the freezer just so it won't go bad. And then uh, we're out of ketchup. So I got this one and got some sharp cheddar for the broccoli soup. I needed it to load up on pepperonis. So I got these. And oh my god, guys, Gouda cheese it is so good. You need to try it. You really, really, really need to try it, guys. I know my like trying to do like a like a New York accent, but I'm killing it. It's like so hard, but I love it. Anyways, Gouda cheese. Oh my god, this is so good. If you can get it from Amazon Fresh, you need to get it from Amazon Fresh. But this Roth brand, oh my god, it's delicious. Two things of broccoli florets, and then uh, picked up some Philadelphia cream cheese, and then some unsalted butter, some baby bella, uh, some pickles, and oh, look at this, guys. These are already prepped. I'm gonna throw them in the freezer. But uh, I, uh, these are stuffed portobello mushrooms with cheese sharp cheddar cheese mozzarella cheese and jalapeno divine like all you have to do is just pop them in the oven and they are ready and oh yeah picked up also some jalapenos to make jalapeno papas look what i made guys i ended up by the way it's the next day sorry uh but i ended up making the broccoli and cheddar keto soup i am gonna link it down below because i followed a recipe from this guy on youtube so i'm gonna put it down below so you guys can see but i already taste it did and it's so good well i tasted it to see if like it was good on salt but it tastes so so bomb the only thing that i'll say that i added on here that was different uh that he didn't put on his was cream cheese uh just like a little bit of it and yeah tell me that doesn't look absolutely delicious really good. oh my god right valerie with some crackers even without crackers, it's just so good. Like, look at that Panera what? And by the way, look at that. We just washed dishes yesterday. <laughs> yep. <laughs> We're going for a coffee run. Yeah. So. Well, she's going for a coffee run. I'm going for a mango dragon fruit run. Yes. Uh, 
okay so my mom is coming over and so i'm just tidying up the place just a bit um the dishes are just gonna have to stay like that like honestly i'm not even gonna worry about it like it's just i'll just have to get to them later uh but i went and i got my blonde americano because they stopped making blonde roast at 11 o'clock and it's already much past 11 o'clock already all right my loves uh, that is it for this video uh you guys might not see a video every single day just because uh we'll be working and um it's just gonna be very difficult to try to film when i'm supposed to be sleeping to be able to go to work so bear with me guys but for the most part i'm gonna do my best to get so many videos out as best as i can but yeah guys love you guys so so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye